So the first thing I'll teach you all is how to find the derivative since that's a big part of calculus. So the derivative of y becomes y prime, and then over here you multiply the exponent by the number in front of x, so that's 10x, and then you subtract 1 from the exponent, so that's just 1, plus you do the same here, so that's 3, and 1 minus 1 is 0, and anything to the 0th power becomes 1, so that's that, and then the derivative of a constant becomes 0, so you're left with 10x plus 3. So that's literally half a semester of calculus. The other half is finding the integral, which is also called the antiderivative. So you have x squared times 5 over 2 because the derivative of this becomes 5x plus 4x because the derivative of 4x becomes 4. And instead of squiggly, now you got a solid line, 0 to 2, plug in 2, squared 5 over 2 plus 4 times 2, minus, plug in 0, 0 plus 0, and you're left with... 20 over 2 plus 8 equals 18. And that is basically one year's worth of calculus.